but you want it on the inside of Quattararo into the southern loop, on the inside of the latest Fargo with a hard move into the middle corner, relieved by Bagnaia, he's third. What a start though for the first lap from Jorge Martin, him and Mark Marquez have pulled a bit of a gas, there's a big move coming from Alex Marquez, trying to force his way, past Luca Rini, Jack Miller is walking in a bit of a battle, he was side by side with his teammate Bagnaia on the approach into two corner, but he's now back down to place, he's back where he started in P8. Now the what bother is coming in for Fabio Quattro because he's got one of the rapidly quick the Nattis behind him going down the start of the strike. Those two final left-handers. There's Alex Marquez, played this by the younger Marquez sibling. He's on the inside of Marina there through the southern loop. Contrasting four chiefs from Prima Parra racing on the first lap. Martin leads the Grand Prix from Mark Marquez. But Joan Zarco has had a shock and down 12 places to 18. Nightmare then for the French winners. Oh, gets out wide again. He sees that spin a corner. He had a problem there running wide through the stone court on the very first lap. Been a bit of a scrappy second lap this for Fabio Quattararo. Martin then and Marquez, they're only trying to build up an advantage here early on. At the end of that first lap, Marquez was nearly eight tenths of a second ahead of Bagnaia in third spot. Oh, Bagnaia really, really, really hot going through the Haitian, hey, he was right on those curves. You've got to be careful, they might still be a little bit damp from this morning's heavy rain. Alicia Spargo's eyes will light up as well to that. Here he comes, Lloyd, he's having a look at the inside into MG, and they're now going three of Bresta's Miller, forces his way back. Luca Marini, he's already got past Alex Marquez on this lap, he now takes Marini, so Miller now in a very good position to help his teammate Bagnaia, he's up behind Quattararo. He made that fit quite brilliantly, did he there, Jack Miller, was not a the room there, but he hugged the inside line and squeezed on the inside of Marine. Nothing. Clearly, as 
we suspected there wouldn't be, as we hoped there wouldn't be. So keyboard and Jackson. Three left 
is all slipping away from the Frenchman. His grasp on this MotoGP World Championship is loosening by the second. What's happening to Fabio Quattrola? We're on board with the World Champion. He's going into the Southern Loop. This is turn two where Rins has been so, so strong. The front goes out for the Fabio Quattrola. It's not been and that, that is it. A body blow for his world title hopes. It is head in hand then for factory Yamaha boss Lee Jarvis. So we've lost Jack Miller at this Grand Prix. We have now lost Fabio Quattararo. It could well be going to Malaysia in next, well, next weekend. A two horse race for this title between Fega Banyaya and the latest Spargaro. Well Quattararo is now just going to hold the Banyaya doesn't score many points. leader and then down to Luca Marini in 8th place, they were split by just 1.6 seconds it's like a Moto3 strap isn't it in MotoGP here in Australia who is going to hang in there though as the tyre wear plays a big factor in the final laps of this Grand Prix it's around the sort of lap 14 to 15 point where we expect the tyre wear to really kick in and we'll find out just how much rubber rights are introduced as a hook Ben Zeki looks like he's shaping there for a move on Van Yaya, but we're on board with the in-play wide world championship leader and as you can see he is still ahead for Marco Benzeki. It'll be interesting to see how Benzeki plays this because it looks like he's got the pace to continue his march forwards in this Grand Prix but it has to be very, very careful if he's making a move on Van Yaya. Oh, 
to the front as we look now back Look through this field, Mike Nyer sitting in second place. He'll be looking just to maximise the points here. He doesn't need to win this Grand Prix, but he needs to take advantage. That's what it would mean. It's Bezzecki now on the inside of Martin. Martin oh, really needs to beat no. that badly on this 14 black. He started in the lead. He's now down to fifth. Oh. Keep a close on his prima pack my teammate, Johan Zarco, oh, who's no. got to the 17th on here. Zarco back inside oh. the top nine now. Quickest found the circuit last time around. A 129.622. scores the last four Grand Prix. It's all gone holding right. The worst 